Hello everyone and welcome to this short little message. So I just wanted to jump on today just to let you know that I am dealing with some ascension symptoms today. I'm dealing with a frozen shoulder on the right side and it's been so intense over the past couple of days that I've had to have a little bit of time off and I haven't been able to reply to comments or, you know, go on my phone much because I'm struggling to even hold my phone. And that's why I'm recording videos like this today. So I'm actually recording on my phone. I've got a flip phone, so it has actually flipped up so I can face it towards, you know, and, and show you the card. So that's what I'm going to do today. So hopefully I'll be able to show my face on camera again soon. I just wanted to let you know why I'm doing it this way and to let you know that, you know, I'm, I've got all the energy to do everything. I just haven't got a working arm right now, so it's quite hard for me. And, you know, it's all the burdens that the masculines are carrying around. So what I've done is I've pulled us a card from the Star Wars deck. I have no idea what this card is. I'm excited to see what it is. So this is just some general guidance for the day. So the message is, look at this, we've got Yoda. True wisdom comes from both knowledge and experience. But you don't have to live 900 years to become wise. Teach yourself one new thing a day. Wisdom comes in many forms. What a powerful message. So we are gaining wisdom right now on this journey and in the school of life, in our day-to-day -day life, so that we can focus more on love and less on fear. And wisdom comes in many forms. So I feel this is also reminding you of why we go through the things we go through. You know, we learn the lessons to experience them. So we can understand them from a first-hand point of view. We understand by learning about the journey, but also experiencing the journey. And we don't have to live 900 years to become wise. So you're already an old soul. So I feel that saying to you, you know, it doesn't matter how old you are physically. It doesn't matter how old your twin is physically. You are the same soul age. And you've had many, many, many lifetimes. So you may just be a certain age in this life. Like, you know, I'm 46 in this life, but I possibly have lived on the earth for 900 years in different lifetimes. And you've been reminded of that. And when you fully immerse yourself in who you are, you understand that, wow, you have to go through the experiences to gain the knowledge. And some of those experiences hurt physically, hurt your emotions hurt your heart because that's how we grow we grow and learn through everything we go through on this journey in this life so we have to teach ourselves to stand strong to remember who we are that we are a warrior and to teach ourselves new things every day to keep pushing on to keep striving on saying i'm not going to let this beat me i'm not going to let this knock me down i'm bigger than this trigger tougher than this challenge I'm stronger than anything that comes at me because I walk with angels. I have the power of God within me. I have the armor of God on me and I am strong and I can deal with it because I am me. And that's what the angels want you to know. So if you're going through anything today that feels, you know, like you can't do your normal job or you can't go around your normal routine, it's affecting you. It could be a physical thing like I'm going through. Or maybe you just don't want to do things today because you're in pain or, you know, your heart is hurting. Remember, you are bigger than that trigger. But give yourself some time to replenish you and do you. And that's what they want you to know. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.